Hey, what's up, guys? This is Blackline Android HD, and today, after a long period of time, uh, when I was uh, an active in my an active in my channel, my Blackline Android HD channel, uh, today I finally decided to make a video on how to flash Eco ROM latest version version 36.1 um, a few things about it it is uh, an s5 an s5 port and what do i mean by that uh, it contains some um, some features from uh, from galaxy s5 uh, like uh, ultra power saving mode and other apps ported from the famous galaxy s5 already and let's give it a try. As always, I usually recommend for you if you're running a custom ROM or if you don't want to lose settings and so on, just go into recovery and uh, straight to sorry, straight to backup and restore thing uh, option here and click backup to backup uh, your current ROM to your SD card. In case if someone and something goes wrong, you will be able to restore your backup from your internal card, so there won't be any problems with it. So, uh, right now I I have the proper ROM, the actual ROM, stocked in my into my internal SD card, onto my internal SD card, and all I have to do, all you have to do now, now is uh, to wipe data, clean to install a new ROM. We've got a We've got a new settings uh, setting over here in uh, fields fields recovery touch. As you can see here, it says wiping data for mating uh, uh, data in cache, of course. And uh, meanwhile, I will tell you. I will tell you that. Uh, I hadn't had any time for reviews, for walkthroughs or for gameplays uh, during the latest, uh, latest mounts, mounts because um, because I was I had a problem with uh, with the time and uh, high school started it uh, isn't summer it isn't holiday uh, holiday will arrive here actually the <coughs> the winter holiday in about one month or so. And uh, uh, the wipe is ready, wipe is done, and that's why I decided to to entertain you right now with a new review on how to flash Eco ROM. In case you would want to flash this ROM, you will see now how to flash it. And of course, as uh, I used to do in the past, I will do a, a preview after afterwards I flash it. So install zip from SD card right now choose it from SD card and we'll scroll down until we, we see S4 Eco ROM right here and then we'll go to and say yes and now it will boot into a ROM installer as always every single ROM right now has a, an aroma installer okay now it's booting into a ROM installer I guess so or not Well, this ROM doesn't have a ROM installer. Um, let me let me search through through the website. So this made this ROM is is made by Friedrich 420. All credits goes to them to him. Features based on the latest Android 4.4. To official Samsung firmware NH7 with Eco's own L kernel with incredible S incredible incredible S5 ported ultra poic saving mode by Tamirda. So I don't think it has the Aroma installer. Actually, I don't know if you can see, but that little bar over there at the bottom kind of loads up something but we'll see after after a couple of time meanwhile I will tell you some um, some features this ROM comes with um, it's the exit of course it has XFAT, XFAT support um, 
complete phone DPI control, Viper front rate, this is important, it tweaks the sound to the maximum level, OG battery mode, amazing eco lock screen flare effect, hmm, and other, other cool things that are found in every single ROM right now for Galaxy S4. But I guess the most important thing and that's why you came here for is the is that this ROM is actually in S5 port. So we'll see how it behaves because I'm kind of skeptical about um, about uh, ported ROMs, especially ported from S5. I tried a couple and I wasn't really satisfied with the with the result. So we'll see how it be, be how this ROM actually behaves. So um, So I guess I guess the ROM has finished flashing. So right now it's booting up. So Galaxy S4, GTI 2005. Okay, so we got the stock S5 boot animation. Samsung, Samsung, great. And we've got the LED flashing right here, which means it's booting up. And we'll see how it behaves. Actually, of course, first boot may take a little longer. You may you may know that, but if you if you don't, you you're about to to know. So, as uh, 3D himself himself says here, um, talking about installation instructions, it sa he says that uh, you will need to do a clean install every single time you flash one of his ROMs you will need a clean install so that's what I did right here wipe full wipe cleaning for a new ROM and what uh, what uh, I strongly recommended uh, is that uh, was that uh, you you should have uh, done an Android backup before um, Any other things? Let me check here. Okay, the room the room is booting up. Fingers fingers crossed. You know, it's all it's all normal until you you hear that uh, that vibration. You feel that vibration from coming out from your Galaxy S4. Well, the weather outside seems to be rainy. Hmm. Things to do while while waiting for your device to boot up. Here comes the vib vibration, and uh, it should be booting up. It should be booted actually. Yes. So we have. Samsung Galaxy okay so let me so Slovenia we should uh, check English United States Wi-Fi So we've got the Wi-Fi over here. Let me connect to my to my network right here. Okay, obtaining IP address. And it's connected. Okay, I understand and no thanks. I don't want to provide any information. So I don't. I haven't got any Google account. I just want to check what. Um, 
how this uh, phone behaves. Okay, usual stuff. Finish. Okay, so okay, that was some lag, but I guess it's okay because it's building cash and so on. Mobile data should be off. Do not show again. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Thank you, weather. I love this widget. Oh, I guess the first one is the Galaxy S5. Galaxy S. No, it's the Galaxy S4 settings. And this is the Galaxy S5 settings. Eco customization. Well, the first thing you'll notice, and I guess it's a bug, is that uh, you have a percentage of battery right in center of the of the proper battery icon, and uh, also right next to it. So, I guess you you could uh, you could disable it by going here and yes hide this and the second thing I observe is uh, the eco customization part right here which includes them teams modes and uh, s4 kitchen backgrounds animations and so on and we've got three minute battery mode with this uh, Okay, now we'll choose. Uh, I like this button, this this one. Well, it's kind of big, but you know, LED manager, CPU spy, and uh, usual stuff right here. We've got themes, themes that uh, that go with the with the touch with launcher. Samsung Basic is the stock one default. We've got here's S voice um location services are current currently off. Agree, but if I okay so this is the widget showing the where um yeah well at first sight it seems to be kind of kind of smooth but problems may occur photos oh thanks Google photos I didn't know Google had a photos photo app okay strange We've got a couple of, actually, a ton of applications right here. And most of them are ported from the S5. Not this, but I guess messages are. Yes, messages are ported. Phone application. Okay, so... Hmm. Okay, we've got my magazine right here. Well, it's fluid, but uh, let's see the lock screen. Well, I guess it behaves so, 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 such, uh, so laggy at the beginning because it built cache, but you know, you won't experience this type of problem when, uh, when firstly, firstly browsing through an uh, S4 stock ROM for example and you can see that there's some lag okay Google okay this works perfectly um so do I recommend this ROM 
at first sight it seems to be a perfect S5 S5 ported ROM. If you you'd like to run into S5 uh, I don't know how to say it personalization stuff and so on and to have uh, the stock S5 look but uh, there's a matter of, of choice right now if you wanna go for for an um, S5 port just go for it and if you like if you like it to stay on it if you don't uh, stick to an S4 ROM uh, in the next video I will show you how to flash the I don't know how Goldfinger yes the Goldfinger Goldfinger ROM for iBasted and it's also an S5 ported ROM and I hope uh, I will see a difference between this and that so until then guys if you like this video please thumbs up make sure you share it so any any Android user that uh, would like to flash some custom RAM will see it and uh, of course please uh, subscribe to my channel I'll get back to you guys in a couple of minutes with the Goldfinger flashing so stay tuned guys bye bye